Hello, my name is Sean and I study software engineering at the University of West Florida. I picked this major mainly because I enjoy working with a, a, a group of people and uh, the idea of software engineering is to collaborate with uh, a, a big team to develop a, a software that is very complex and is produced to the masses. And so eventually what I would like to do with this career is I would like to work for a big time company like Google or Microsoft, companies that actually use utilize big teams to develop big software. Software engineering has a lot of programs uh, and classes that help you help get you comfortable in working with big teams. And um, some of these courses, for instance, is Software Engineering 2, where you actually are in a classroom and you collaborate with your colleagues to find a client, find the needs of that client, and then develop software for that client throughout the entire semester. Uh, it's a challenge, but it's very, very rewarding at, at the end. Um, some other things you'll learn in software engineering is uh, several types of languages, C and Java, just to name a few. Um, in Java, you'll be learning Java 1, 2, and 3. Uh, the reason being is because Java is an object-oriented language, and in terms of software development, that's really big and critical in that, in that degree. In addition, you'll also be taking database systems and things regarding the database. It's important because in today's world, a lot of software and a lot of things that you interact with, like social networking, just to name, name something off the top of my head, requires database skills and skill sets. And so you'll be learning that as well. And at the end of this program, you'll also be doing a capstone project, which essentially takes everything you've learned and apply it to that one final project. Database, languages, software engineering concepts and practices. Um, it's a lot of fun, especially once you get to towards the end of your program. In software engineering, uh, one of my favorite parts was actually being submitted into a classroom. And then the very first thing that the teacher says is, um, hey, you're going to be collaborating with your colleagues to create this giant project for a client. And so they'll throw you into a pool of clients. You pick one, you figure out the needs and wants of that client. And then you collaborate with your colleagues based off what you learned to develop software for this client. And then, of course, you know, you apply and you execute it towards the end. It's a lot of fun for me per personally. I redesigned, or I, but my team redesigned our school web our school website along with the map uh, portion of it. So it was a great experience. Um, things like that are actually the core values of software engineering: learning how to collaborate with other people to make these big these big software possible. With any engineering degree. Uh, software engineering incorporates several languages and you have to be really advanced with those languages. So you'll take several courses throughout the program and um, it is quite difficult but um, and they're very challenging. So if, I if you were to be asked what is the hardest thing in software engineering, you'd probably be learning the languages and applying them to formulate big algorithms and to solve big problems that happen in software engineering. Something I, f I, I feel I should mention is that there is math in this degree um, up to Calc 2. Uh, if you're like me, uh, math was never a strong point. But once you overcome that, it's actually, you don't see a lot of hard math concepts applied to software engineering. I can't say computer science, but for software engineering, I can. Um, mainly because it's more, it, software engineering stresses more on collaboration and things of that nature, not so much of the algorithm part. It's important, but it's not actually the whole idea of the picture of software engineering. In closing, um, if you are thinking about software engineering, some things that I would say to encourage you to do so is software engineering is a lot of fun if you enjoy using computers. If you, and not just for basic necessities, but actually have questions of how a computer works. How does a computer tie in with the rest of the world? How does, you know, things of that nature. And if you enjoy that, then take a look at software engineering because with computers, computers are the future. And, and if you enjoy using them, Software engineering can be a great outlet to not only to you know as a career, but also as a hobby or just a way to express yourself.